It's very common for filming locations to have different lighting sources. Your footage may sometimes be left with a bluish or orange color cast. In this tutorial, we show you how to use ColorDirector's white balance tool to instantly fix this problem. First, import your footage into ColorDirector. Here we have some footage of a marathon with an unfortunate bluish tint. Drag the video into the tray at the bottom and then select the Adjustment tab at the top. Click the Global Adjustment Tools tab, the White Balance tab. The White Balance tool is comprised of the Eyedropper tool, the Temperature slider and the Tint slider. The first thing to do is to select the Eyedropper tool. Identify a zone in your footage containing an object that should be white for example a person's t-shirt, and click that specific zone, ColorDirector will automatically adjust the temperature and the tint options for the entire video scene. You can also manually adjust the temperature and the tint options to achieve the look you want. Let's start with the temperature. Click on the cursor and drag to the right or to the left. To the right, you will warm up the color tones of your footage by adding more orange tones. To the left, you will cool down the color tones by adding bluish tones. Since we need to warm up the overall color tones of the footage, let's move the slider a bit to the right. Once you're satisfied with your temperature changes, you can modify the tint option. To the right, you will add more magenta tints to your footage, hence intensify the warmer feeling. And to the left, you will add more green tints, which gives a cooler feeling to your footage. Let's move the slider to the right. Another quite handy feature of ColorDirector is to be able to save your settings so you can quickly apply them in the future to similar footage. Click the Create button at the bottom. Then name your preset and decide which options you want to include or remove. Finally, click Save to add your preset into ColorDirector's embedded presets or share if you want to upload your preset to directorzone.com for other video editors to use. You will find your newly saved preset in the My Created Preset section. To apply them to other footage, just click it. It will be applied automatically and instantly.